Hey, thank you for clicking on the video. Uh, today we're gonna react to Geek Love, which is a show made 11 years ago about geeks trying to find love. Geeks as in nerds. And this episode was very funny. It was about a person called Alex that is a brawny, which is quite, you know, quite the thing to be. <laughs> Alright, enjoy. If you like it, make sure to like and subscribe if you want. If you don't, that's okay. Alright, enjoy. Why am I so like excited to show you guys this? <laughs> All right. Your geek soulmate. This is there we go. You can hear it. Oh my god, are you a brony? Oh yes, I am. Oh my god. The girls that I really do like just want to be friends. I'm kind of like nervous sitting around you right now. What kind it's of like it's... Aww. What? Aww, such a dummy, so. Around you right now. What comics are you reading? I have a lady boner for Winter Soldiers. I have a lady boner. Who got a lady boner here? Over 18? I'm 13. You're 13? Yes. Inches. It's a good no. Oh. All right. <laughs> good one. Ha <laughs> ha. Why was it so quick to say no to that? Like what? <laughs> are you 13? Inches. No. <laughs> no. No. Inches. It's a good no. Oh. Around. Uh, maybe around. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Looking for guys or girls? Oh, girls. Definitely. Okay. <laughs> it's not gay. Okay. I I'm Alex, I am 25, and I am a giant geek. He's not gay, and he doesn't have a 13 inch. I usually get at Comic Con, it's all up on the walls here. Every kind of trip to Comic Con, I usually get a lot of po art. My love life status is a mix of Forever Alone and Socially Awkward Penguin. Ah. It's meme tastic. Ah. Oh. that I love. Ah. Rose Red from Fable. I hate his beard, I hate his humor even more. Love redheads. Meme tastic? Who said that? Who says is, that? Uh, this piece here, just all redheads. <laughs> I'm a renaissance geek. I like comics. I like board games. I love Doctor Who. And, uh... Oh, I don't judge brony. either. Okay, I judge a lot. So He's a brawny. My little pony. Okay, this Freak! Is, uh, Pinkie Pie, she likes to party. Bro. So, uh, this is Bro. Jack here. Uh, she's, she owns a farm. Bro, shop, I was and, uh, my little pony when I was, like, no nonsense, nine. <laughs> And even I was like, this is weird. <laughs> Every Thursday, I go to board game night in Brooklyn. And he got the booger. Oh my god, he got the snot mobile with the snot shirt. That's sick. My favorite thing about board games is how it can bring people together. What kind of girl do you want to meet when you go to What the hell is a Sally face? Oh, is that the game? No, seriously though, like what type of girl would you optimally like to meet? Just friends. I guess you, but not crazy and hyper. So you essentially want my non-evil twin. Yeah. When was this? I feel like I think this was eleven years ago. Okay. Well, he shaved the exact places that should have grown out his beard. Actually, that dude is right. Yeah, I guess. It's a little creepy. Yeah. Since I'm discussing, yeah. Some of my challenges with girls are just the girls that I really do. I don't like these people. Really just want to be friends. Well, I, kind of I don't hate them. Ask? Oh yes, I am. Oh my god. That's my reaction. With MMOers, right? No, it is. Yes, it is. I'm referencing. So, okay, I'm going to pretend I'm sitting here and I'm cosplaying as Neil Gaiman's death, okay? <laughs> so you would come up to me. Some of my challenges with girls are just talking to some of them. Who would have thought? Hi, my name is Alex. I'm Carolyn. Nice to meet you, Carolyn. Nice to meet you, too. So, I, I guess you're into Neil Gaiman, but the, uh... I do, I yeah. like him a lot. I really like all of his comics. So kind of Playing Magic or Yu-Gi-Oh? Uh, I'm, I'm a big fan of comics. I think Yu-Gi-Oh. I like ponies. That's cool. Uh, I'm, I'm a big fan of comics. What else are you into? I like ponies. Okay, she's just making fun of him. <laughs> she's just making fun of him, okay. Hopefully, you know, I meet someone there that I really do like, that I'm really interested in, you know. Hopefully you really think so? You think he's play, you know, he plays magic? Oh, no. Actually, I play I magic, like come on. <laughs> Please. <laughs> don't do me like that. There's no point. That's called stalking. I'm joking, I don't play magic. I, I like the card games, but I can't get into them. Magic is so much, I feel like. Not Shigio, at least. <laughs> I feel like... Do nerds not like Yu-Gi-Oh? Just like I also play your gear, the other ones. Nobody really wants to be alone. Here come the potential men. What I hope comes out of this is a date. Any date. I think any date, maybe. 
Guys, leave all your bags and stuff over there by that table, under the table. I'm definitely uh, like someone who has red hair, a unique face, you know, someone who doesn't... <laughs> what, what was that? What was that? What do you mean unique face and... Face. Unique face and you put... what? <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Unique face. <laughs> like, not good looking, not bad looking, just... An interesting face. You know, someone who doesn't look like everyone else, maybe? Move on in, okay, what? guys. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to <laughs> What is it trying to find? Do not use this as an it's trying to find like an auger. <laughs> the friend zone sucks. I'm sure he got a lot of experience with it. Is like threading a needle. Me too. For what? Pogo stick, evading sharks with frickin' laser beams attached to their frickin' heads. This is how it feels when talking to you, for what? It's just like I'm fighting sharks with frickin' laser heads? What the fuck did he say? <laughs> Bro, well, that's why he has that beard. Because he's special. Two. <laughs> Speed date. So, uh, how long have you been... So... Having you joined Comic-Con so far? No, 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 no. <laughs> Don't start like that. Come on. Uh, first sentence. So how long have you been a girl, huh? Don't do that, man. Bro already stepped on a trap the first second he opened his mouth. <laughs> first thing to not say. is Sutter. <laughs> uh, I went to us, Dagen. So, uh, how long have you been... So, have you joined Comic-Con so far? <laughs> Bro had like three questions and switched between them at the same time. <laughs> I feel like I don't, this is like a. Oh my god. This is like the fisherman from Sado Valley. I get what he's going for. <laughs> bro is finished. Bro is cocked. Yeah. Not asking for the name. Not asking for anything. Straight up. How long have you been. Yep. So far, it's tough at first, you know. It's like, <laughs> so I'm wearing a red shirt, so I'm kind of like nervous sitting around here. Did he? Did he just? So did he just? Did he? Did he just ignore this, or did I'm they? Just, wearing a red shirt, so I'm kind of like nervous sitting around you right now. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna die. Don't worry. Oh my god, dude. You talk about the most niche shit ever. That's not how you talk to women, man. <laughs> like, oh yeah, you like Star Trek? Uh, long ears, yeah. <laughs> like, okay? <laughs> you should talk about the human, not the not what they like. Like, that's... Why well, am I actually like, giving advice? <laughs> well, yeah, they're geek, but you, you should talk about them more than, you know what they're wearing, what they're doing, you know? A very classical styled geek. I feel like that's what every human likes. People talking about them or knowing more things about them. Being interested in someone. He is, he's proud of it. So, what are you into? I'm into everything. Nice. Okay, he does not like her at all. He hates her already. <laughs> Whereas like, what the fuck have I been into? Nice, yeah. What is loosening up? That's loosening? Bro, if that's loosening, I don't want you to be closed ever. Excuse me? Excuse moi? Uh, this is how you talk to people with. First time you meet in them? Yeah, hey, hey, you put, hey, you putting condoms on bananas? Bro, these people are freaks. You speak French? I do speak French. Ha <laughs> ha! Comment allez vous? <laughs> uh, what's the weirdest museum you've been to? The sex museum. What was this? What is that question? Does anyone have that answer? What's the weirdest museum have you been into? I've been into three. And all of them are not weird. One of them is for fish. And the other is for mammals. And the third one is like for... I don't even remember. For like animals in general. Like none of them are weird, I don't think. 
<laughs> I'm friends. That's good. Oh. Oh, I think so. When you... You did help Ume with French Duolingo. <laughs> oh, in Germany too. There is the sexy museum in... in uh, what was it called? I f forgot the name. I was planning to go to it with my friend because it's funny. You're his friend, Caesar? Please, no. Ugh. I like that she had a, uh, <laughs> you know, you know, sexually funny Kirby shirt on. Uh, sexually funny? Oh, uh, oh, who, who here? Yep. Who here is sexually funny, huh? What's gonna be sexually funny here, huh? Yeah, have you played Journey on PS3? I love it. Oh Journey my god. Awesome. Dude, they, these people are crazy. Kirby sexual. Bro, be sucking up. Okay, never mind. I'm not gonna be rude. So he seemed really interested in what I do, um, and, and he was really nice. You know why he's really nice and interested? Because she has the right hair. It was very fun talking with her, you know. I felt very comfortable with her. Oh, it was really nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too. Bye. Yeah, she was cute. Yeah. Hi. Hi, Idris. Oh, you know who I am. Of course. Okay, let me like make some notes on like. What comics are you reading? I have a baby book. Is it the man I got See? People like th this woman is what I vibe with the most. Because Big Booba, you think so? People like this woman is what I vibe with the most. They just, they don't give a fuck about what they're saying. No, 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 no. This is what I like. His ass attitude. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> the bad boy attitude, got yeah. it. That's sort of a... That's like Lady kind of Bonner, a that's a funny, yeah. funny word. So some of the girls are great. So what are you into? Some of them? What freak. Batman, Batman, Great costume though. How long did it take you? He was a huge fan of Batman. 25. Just like, no, not like you. Close to you for a while. And Harley, so that always gets me going. Quiet please and sit down. Yes, there's three minutes. I know you're not used to Is this you for It's okay. It does look 35, especially with the beard. Yes. When I'm done talking, you're going to find the pieces of paper that correlate to the people that you liked. If you like number five, you'll find number five's page. It'll say number five on it. If you didn't like somebody, don't write anything down. Okay, fair warning. Some of you are going to get no numbers. It happens. I apologize in advance. Just means it wasn't a session for you. I'll oh, write your stuff down. you don't know. The bus I watched the busman one. It's so good. That I want to find uh, that really episode. I like so many of them. I like the girl with the uh, Kirby shirt. I like the girl on the uh, Star Trek too. I'm Batman. Like the ones I like are the ones that everyone likes. Justice. I'm gonna go put my name and number down and see what happens. Gentlemen, sit still, look pretty, puff out your chest. All right, ladies. This is what we call the <laughs> Buddy, match. you don't need to puff out anything. You're already puffed yeah. out. Calm so down. Three minutes with somebody that <laughs> Back, okay? You went on the show? It's hard to know Shut up, fool. Like, you know, sort of <laughs> if I went on the show, there will be no women no more, bro. <laughs> I'm joking. That's so rude. Okay. <laughs> I would not be here, bro. I wouldn't survive. And I was fucking... I was nine when this show was airing, man. <laughs> I'm not gonna go as a nine-year-old talking with these creeps. I need Batman. <laughs> Oh, let's go. Kirby sexual woman. Okay, I told you. I saw this in red hair. Wait. Is that an old man? Is this an old man or just... This looks like an old man. You get the old man drip. No Kirby sexual. Not cute. This has to be an old man. Right Gabe? No, Gabe could, would never. Maybe set up sometime <laughs> this, weekend. this is a wannabe Gabe. I'm 24. 25, nice, good. There's like one 32 year old that still lives with his mom is like, no. Maybe cosplay. <laughs> his cosplay is Gabe. I don't know, I feel like in the 20s it's okay. His cosplay is a real human. No, sorry for talking over what they're saying. Yeah, sure. <laughs> 
you want to yeah, keep we chatting. Could, I could, we could walk around, uh, you know. Yeah. Got it. can walk you back to your booth as This well. is creepy. Okay. <laughs> cool. Thanks. I mean, it's like, you can do it yourself, of course. But, you, but you know, if you want, yeah. you want the company. See, <laughs> this is a big issue is that <laughs> he's overthinking. He's like, Oh, I want to walk you, walk with you. Not that you can't do it alone, but I want to do it. It's like, okay, man, <laughs> you're doing too much. Oh yeah, yeah, the guy that's talking. Sure? He does look like Gabe, doesn't he? But no, he's just a cringe guy. <laughs> the host, uh, a, a dating show. That wasn't a good episode. This is the after story. So, we'll fix the beard. Yeah, what happened after speed dating was that after talking to Kate, basically on camera, uh, cameras are off, and we walked away. And what happened was that basically uh, she told me after about a minute, basically that she just wanted to be friends. So basically, kind of uh, <laughs> nothing ever happened, of course. But okay, I understand, but it, it was kind of depressing. I also understand, man. You know, me, I guess. That's, that's my life. <sighs> it's kind of sad. That part of the day was uh, pretty bad, but the rest of the con was great. I got to Aww. meet basically uh, Bill Willingham, who, did, who writes for Fables. It was awesome. He signed it to me. Sent this awesome piece of art that was free. You know, I got a lot of art. I'm, I'm happy. Uh, he, art. no, no, he got someone, but that person does not. That person did not like him afterwards, he, she that just wants to be friends. Want to make my love life. If anyone of you uh, watching like what they see, contact me at this email here. What? Why would I contact you? Okay. Why, why the hell would I contact you, man? <laughs> I don't want to contact you, what? Leave me alone. I don't want to hear, hear from you ever again, brother.